today we are here at our place i'm supposed to be doing an intimate event for client and i've decided to come with my baby let's see how that plays out as we do the setup uh, i'll try to capture as much as possible the baby side and yeah let's do this Hi guys, so finally I got the footage from the event over the weekend. As you know, on Saturday I had an event. Uh, normally I do small events. No, for stay-at-home moms, you really have to have something going on. Otherwise, you just, there's a lot of frustrations that can come with it by just staying home. So normally I have a few small things running around. Um, and one of them is I do events for small intimate events like dinner dates, anniversaries, proposals. So on Saturday I had a proposal and I decided to take my baby with me to see really how it is. Normally I just send out a team. So this time I wanted to go by myself and see how it is. If I can be comfortable going with the baby for the setups, if it can be, you know, just there, the two of us without me sending out the team and then working remotely. So finally I got the footage and I wanted us to watch it together because I haven't seen it really. And so briefly how it is working with that, with that baby, as you've seen. So she starts out calm and then I think because it's the same thing over and over. She's, she, there's really nothing much happening. It's just people moving around the same. I'm seated at the same place giving instructions. So she, she gets a bit fussy like towards... After a few hours or maybe an hour or so, she, she started getting a, a bit fussy. Uh, so I had to keep going to the car to feed her or just walk around so then she's a bit calm. She sees different things. So that's one thing. So you need to keep her active. You you can't just stay there with her. I think she, she gets bored as well. And then I went with the carrier. I thought it would be easier to just put in the carrier and then move around doing my thing. And then I realized after a while that She's a bit a heavy baby, and I can't keep her in the carrier for, for, for long. Uh, I, I really, really wanted to, to go with the stroller, but I changed my mind last minute because then again, like carrying it downstairs, putting just so much. I decided to maybe the carrier would work. Bad idea. So now I know if, if I go with her next time, I need to have my stroller with me. Even if I go with the carrier, it should just be like for short, for a while, not something that I completely depend on. And then something else, I f I usually I carry a toy, which I did have, but I had it in the car. So I should have taken the toy uh, with me. I don't know. I didn't think about that. Uh, so, yeah. So we were just improvising and finding things to, to keep her busy as well. Mm, but all in all, I think if I plant myself well, I go with the stroller. I make sure I have food with me so I don't have to keep going to the car. I have her toys ready I, uh, just to keep her busy, then I think I can do it. Yeah, it's something I can do. And it's not as hectic as I thought it would be. Or maybe luckily, because I, I had my team there, so then it wasn't as hectic. I could walk away if I wanted to. And it, it, wasn't, a, it wasn't a very, how do you say, a very um, demanding kind of a setup. It was small and intimate, so that, that was easier for me as well. It worked well. And then, so now I have the footage. I think we'll watch it together. And then maybe I can, yeah, just give a brief summary of, of uh, the event and how it, it turned out.
yeah so <laughs> oh, that was so i i didn't think it would turn out that way you know while there but wow that's something else it's it's really it's really amazing and yeah so i, I do events as i've said so events memories i do intimate events if you have your dinner your romantic dinner and you need a setup wherever it is whether it's a hotel whether it's at the mara mombasa it doesn't matter where it is if you want a romantic a romantic dinner date we do the setup if you have a proposal and you want someone to run with it we do that if you have an anniversary and you have no idea what to do we do that we we do end to end uh event planning we provide the flowers everything 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 is so we provide everything so your work is to just tell us exactly what it is you need and then show up on the day and uh, clearly we won't disappoint so uh, yeah once in a while that's what i do among other things i think uh, with time i'll just keep taking you uh, with me to work with the baby and see how it is that i run the small things that i do Uh thank you please don't forget to subscribe share and like and please um stay tuned for the next episode um which will be a few days from now yeah hopefully thank you so much bye